France is planning on lifting its ban on blood donations from gay men. The country's Minister of Health called it the end of a taboo in an interview with French newspaper Le Monde on Wednesday. Many countries put restrictions on blood donations in the 80s during the AIDS epidemic, before it was widely acknowledged that HIV can also be transmitted through other behaviors, including heterosexual sex. The lifetime bans have been criticized for discriminating based on sexual orientation, as opposed to focusing on individual risk factors. In recent years, some of the bans have loosened. In May, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration changed its policy. Instead of a lifetime ban, men who have had sex with another man but haven't done so in the past year are allowed to donate blood. But the change has been criticized by LGBT advocacy groups, who call it a celibacy clause. That's right. 365 days of celibacy. France will also be adopting a similar one-year deferral rule. If studies on new donations don't indicate a risk, the country's Minister of Health says rules for gay men will eventually be more like those for heterosexual donors. In May, the US FDA cited a similar policy change in Australia, saying there was no change in risk to the blood supply. For Newsy, I'm Samantha Crook.